Hello everyone and welcome to AV Atmos. Um, if you are new to our platform and you like audio video technology uh, around the cinema business, be sure to subscribe right now to our channel and hit the bell so you will be notified when our next content has actually been released. Now, um, the news for today in the audio world is the fact that Emotiva has finally launched officially now the XMC2 uh, pre-pro processor for home theater use and it's kind of like the mid-range not really the mid-range it's kind of like their low-end version of the rmc1 now as you guys know they launched a rmc1 earlier this year officially um giving you the ability to get full discrete 16 channels of processing and an expandability to 28 channels uh if you want to expand your home theater um, up to that number now in recent time they have been able to um, bring down the price because the RMC one has been priced at five thousand dollars and they wanted a situation whereby they give um, audio lovers um, better sound or kind of like the same sound that you get from the RMC one uh, but uh, in a low of price point because the rmc1 cost five thousand um, dollars they looked for a way to get people to use their 16 channels of processing at a lower price point hence they launched their rmc2 um, and the xmc2 now the rmc2 is going to be called the rmc1 version 2 i think it has a weird name to it um, but the xmc2 is similar to the rmc1 version 2 the only difference is that um, you get a, a smaller display um, oled panel in front which is just a single screen as opposed to the dual um, like the larger screen on the rmc1 and the rmc1 version 2 and uh, the rmc1 version 2 would not give you the expandability option whereas the um the rmc1 can give you the expandability option to 28 channels and as well you get fully differential um, output per channel to 16 channels all balanced but the um the xmc2 will only give you differential output on your first front three channels and all the remaining channels are on stereo output now don't get confused at times with all these um audio outputs uh, that you get from so many of these manufacturers claiming that they will outperform so many at times these things work but most of the times you may not really hear the difference i really do not think that if you if you're going for the xmc2 you will lose out so much of an audio quality difference uh, when compared to the X, um, rmc1 um, i would advise that one could go for the rms uh, xmc2 because of the fact that you're not only saving two thousand dollars but with that two thousand dollars you can actually budget it to buy amplifiers and i can recommend an emotive amplifiers that you can get and you can actually get the basics uh, 5175 they're five channel um basics 5175 now granted it's only going to have x um rca inputs what it means is that you have to buy a converter a converter splitter that can convert xlr outputs to rca input uh, they sell a bunch of those cables on amazon and um, you can also channel that two thousand extra dollars that you would have spent getting the x rmc one to buy a proper amplifier like the dr3 the differential amplifier so it kind of like runs your front three um channels on in differential mode while the other stereo pair can actually go to stereo amplifiers from emotiva or any other brand like monoprice or uh, parasound and outlaw audio yes there are a lot of power amplifiers amplifier companies out there so guys that is basically the news feed for today you can actually go out there and purchase this from emotiva and um, check out their website at emotiva.com i'm hoping to get a sponsorship deal from emotiva very soon i've contacted them before and they actually shipped to my country so with time guys i'll start bringing you emotiva content on this channel uh, because i really love the company they're doing a great job um not a perfect job but they are doing a great job for the products that they manufacture 
and I actually like some of their products, especially their power amplifiers. So if you like this content, go ahead, subscribe to our channel and keep watching, guys. Once again, my name is Michael, and I'll catch you guys very much next time.